you're gonna tell the story of Texas Soul, the hotbed was, was San Antonio. It's impossible to tell that story without honoring the place that, that birthed a lot of that. San Antonio is a very Mexican-derived population. Um, we're also a military town, so we get a lot of uh, diversity through that. And you had black dudes, you had white dudes, you had Mexicanos, you know, a big melting pot of all that. And it created something very unique, yeah. It's particularly what you call the West Side Town amongst Chicanos and Latinos. And that's partly responsible by two men, uh, Manny Guerra and another gentleman by name of A.B. Epstein. Between those two, they spawned dozens of labels, recorded hundreds of artists, and over like 10,000 hours worth of recording time in their studio. San Antonio is a deep Chicano presence, deep Chicano roots, you know, one of the oldest cities here in Texas. Very Mexican, there's a lot of Mexican emphasis. But then there was that harsh reality of racism and discrimination that, that you know, Chicanos were still facing here in San Antonio. I can see how a young musician, you know, who can't use a water fountain, can't, you know, go to a swimming pool, can identify with black American music. You know, you had Chicanos really interested in soul, really identifying with the music, wanting to perform it. I mean, they're looking at, you know, what James Brown is doing and, and really wanting to do their own thing. And I think that's the beautiful thing about San Antonio, because you hear it in the music. 